Pixel Trade CTO Austin Blake outed as fake actor. Now, before we get started, make sure you like, share, subscribe, click that bell icon so every time we're going to do a video, you will be notified right away. And also in the description box below, I have two steps. Step one, visit my website, themillionairejob.com. If you want to learn how to build a passive income online step by step, that is 100% legit. And step two is join my Facebook group where I provide a ton of value. All you have to do is answer three questions and I will approve you. So Vixel Trade, CTO Austin Blake, outed as hired fake actor. So a lot of MLM companies in the crypto space have been using these actors to play their executive teams in the past year or two. I could safely say that 2020 was a year of the fake actors. Looks like Bixel Trade hired some people from the USA to play their executive team. Just a quick recap. Bixel Trade has Benjamin Gibson, Sophia Claire, and Austin Blake, and Stephen Lowell as their executive team. But Austin Blake has been caught. But I'm sure he doesn't know. <laughs> He's been playing a fake actor or like a fake exec, but I'm not sure. But to, to be honest... I'm not going to hold him accountable only because, I don't know, he probably doesn't even know. But anyway, Austin Blake's real name is Dennis Mellon, who is an actor and producer and has been known for the uh, uh, movies like The Matter Hatter, Life's Rewards, and Daddy We're Back. Uh, he is quite the following on Instagram with over 50,000 followers. As you can see by his Instagram profile, he's an actor and a bunch of other stuff under his belt. I don't have any... Again, I don't have anything against him, but he should have looked into the role when it comes to playing a fake CTO. Did he really think it was just an acting job or did he know he was hired to deceive people? That, I don't know. Uh, in Bixel Trade's marketing material, I have, I found three videos where it was all about Austin Blake explaining the company and what they do. So this is one of them. CTO safely measures to ensure investments are safe. Bixel Trade, Bixel FinTech. Now, in this video, he sounds like he doesn't, it doesn't sound natural. It's scripted, and obviously it's scripted because now we know he's an actor. Uh, looks like Benjamin Gibson, Sophia Claire, and Stephen Lowell are still, are not identified, but I can safely say they're probably not real names either. So if you know anything about them, please in the comment section below, let me know so I can get this out as soon as possible. There are so many crypto MLMs that have used fake actors to deceive people out of millions of dollars. Every company that is structured this way has exit scammed at one point, And I just want to educate the public on how to detect these scams. In my original Bixel Trade review, I did call out the company as a Ponzi scam or Ponzi scheme. And did mention how the management team doesn't have a real digital footprint. The company offers a fixed 2% daily return with no external income proof to back it up. As of right now, I'm going to small reports, like I've been getting small reports on Bixel Trade already having issues paying out. If you are in this company and if you can confirm that, let me know in the comment section below. So there we have it. One actor down. Um, from Bixel Trade. And just so you know, Benjamin Gimpson, Gimps, Gimpson was also a manager or owned, I don't know if you heard of mini.cc that exit scammed in 2020. Uh, he was put on the Hong Kong registration papers for the corporation, same as this company. They got a Hong Kong incorporation as well with his name on it. But anyway, we got one down. Let's find out who these three are. Once we find that out, uh, they will never be playing actor fake CEOs ever again. And that's the whole point of this. We want to ensure that this doesn't keep happening. I mean, this is a very strong trend where they're hiring fake people to deceive people. So if I can educate the public better on this, I can get this information out there and then less people will fall for this kind of shenanigans. And also, when it comes to these returns, I mean, this thing's promising 2% returns daily. 
I mean, that doesn't even sound logical. That's about over 60% a month. Think about it logically. If they really had that ability legally, they won't. They will not need actors. They will not need anything. They will get a handful of investors and just crush it, become billionaires in a short few years. And honestly, instead of investing in companies like this, invest in yourself so you can learn the skills on how to actually make passive income online. You know, thousands of people, maybe hundreds of thousands of people are making a killing online legally and they have the right skills on to do that where, you know, instead of investing in these scams or getting exit scammed over and over again and losing out, take that money, invest in yourself, get a proper education on how to build a passive income online and then just crush it. You don't, you know, you can make more than 60% ROI in a month. I mean, all, most of my offers that I promote are anywhere between 50 to 200% return on my ad spend. So, I mean, if you know how to do that, you don't need to invest in companies like this. So anyway, that's it for the news. Make sure you like this video, share this video, subscribe, click that bell icon. So every time I bring a new video, you'll be notified right away. And again, if you want to learn how to build that passive income online properly, where you have the skills and no one can take them away from you, visit my website, themillionairejaw.com on learn how to learn how to do that step by step. Now, this is about equipping you with the right skills so you don't have to invest in Ponzi scams over and over again. And step two is join my Facebook group where I provide a ton of value. All you have to do is answer three questions and I will approve you. And again, all that stuff is in the description box below. That's it for this video and I'll see you in the next one. Take care, buddy.